A Cole Alpha Secondary in North Burnaby is one of five high schools in the city that could be moving to a staggered schedule because of overcrowding. A staggered schedule means students won't all attend at the same time, with the school day starting earlier and ending later in order to add an additional block of classes. For some, that could mean starting as early as 8 in the morning. That would be very stressful for me personally, just because I don't do good in mornings. Like, I don't even have a first period. I've just been hearing a lot of grade 8s complain about this because most of them stay up till 1, 2. And, like, teenagers out of every age group need the most sleep statistically. Um, so it's actually better for school to start at, like, 9 for teenagers than actually earlier. With the explosion of residential high-rises at nearby Brentwood, Alpha is bursting at the seams. The school was upgraded in 2019, but not built nearly big enough. It's the same thing down the road at Burnaby North Secondary, home of the Vikings, and possibly the new staggered schedule. Burnaby North was over capacity the first day it opened in January after extensive upgrades. We've been seeing the problem growing. The chair of the Burnaby District Parent Advisory Council says staggered schedules create all sorts of potential issues. Concerns around um, how is it going to affect extracurricular activities, how is it going to affect families when you've got multiple children and one starting at one time, one starting at another. Every Burnaby Familyville High School student got this letter today. This Burnaby PAC member took to social media to highlight the proposal. He says schools will only become even more overcrowded without a change in planning. This isn't really a school district problem or even a school board problem. This is a problem with how schools are built at the provincial level. Burnaby School Superintendent Karim Hashleff was not available for an interview. In a statement, he says, the pace of growth at many of our high schools is such that we can't wait to build ourselves out of the capacity issues. Karen Larson, CBC News, Burnaby.